Here we go, the Bronco got some new friends today. Here's my morning walk this morning. So a big part of this trip was uh, just being able to hang out at Steve's property. Like I said, he's got a uh, gorgeous couple hundred acres in West Virginia. Um, so I got some panoramic videos. Uh, got a little bit of uh, a deer we saw in one of his pastures uh, on some acres he has below where his cabin is and a little bit of drone footage. So I um, just want to kind of put some of that in here. Um, again, appreciate Steve having me up there and um, just a great time hanging out, working on the sawmill, and uh, really great to see his property. learning real quick this is one of the most important parts of operating a sawmill is how and when you stack different materials so got to have a game plan in place to uh, make sure you're not handle material two and three times this is a pretty good operation here he's got his uh, two by eights along the bottom switch to two by tens all these are 16 footers on dunnage that he can pick up with a forklift on the tractor. These are all the one by leftovers and working on a, a pile of those as well at the same time.
So that was it, uh, first cut at the controls. Um, again, I couldn't thank Steve enough. Uh, very patient with me. Um, I don't think I made any huge mistakes. I definitely didn't wreck any machinery. Um, anytime you own tools or equipment, it's always hard to let somebody else um, use those. So I, I like I said, I can't, can't thank Steve enough for giving me a shot um, to run some of this and uh, very patient with me and a uh, very good mentor as far as uh, teach me you know what to do and, and how to get it done so I absolutely had a blast with this so uh, yeah I'll throw some music on and uh, let you see the rest of uh, my log cut
Well, I couldn't get my camera out fast enough, but I just came up on a uh, little baby bear on the way out, out, out the door from Steve's. I wish I could have got a little picture of it or some video, but I missed that one. So that was it there. Got to uh, saw my first log on a sawmill. Uh, appreciate Steve for letting me come up here and uh, hang out at his place for a couple days and uh, work on the sawmill a little bit. Got to see his property. I think Miss Karen and I will definitely be back uh, probably sometime here before it gets cold. Maybe uh, help Steve saw up some more. So hopefully we'll have uh, another video at, at that point. Uh, but super enjoyed my time up here. Definitely excited, uh, looking forward to getting our own sawmill. Um, wanted to kind of do a test run up here and just to make sure this is something one to do. Uh, definitely interest is still very high in this. So, um, I haven't really discussed this a whole lot, but I do have a sawmill on order and it's actually a, a Timber King, the exact same model that, that Steve has here that we're working on. Um, so definitely happy with all the features on that. Um, so looking forward to getting that. I uh, hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment, click sub subscribe, tell your mama, tell your friends, and we'll see you on the next one. Thank you. Uh -huh.